Hello, today I'm going to draw a landscape with water and wooden bridge. I've always wanted to have such a nice picture and I don't know why never try to draw it. I found the center of the paper and draw the horizon line above the center. I show the silhouette of the mountains and start drawing a bridge. I'm drawing it in a left half of paper. It is important to remember about perspective lines here. The part of the bridge close to me will be wider and the end of the bridge will be narrow. I am adding a railing, a live buoy and a rope. It can be different decorative elements what fit for the bridge. I want to show my bridge like old one, so I not very careful with elements and draw them only in one side. To show that it's old and broken. I make the top of the paper wet and wipe the view from the place where the sun will be with a napkin. This place will be in right part. I start with yellow. Put yellow near the sun. I put ultramarine in the upper part of the sky. Try not to touch yellow part of colors. Try to add some orange, very careful with place with sun. Always use napkin, so I am not scared to make some mistake because napkin helps me a lot. I add more blue in upper part of the sky. I make the place wet where there will be water. Don't scare if some water comes to the bridge. I also can remove it. Or to make bridge more intense color. I 
I start repeating the colors from the top of the picture. So I use some yellow, some orange to show the reflection of the sun in the water I use a napkin again removing moisture from the paper and it turns white for darker color I mix blue and red I put some darker color to the horizontal line and um, draw the near part of the water darker too. When the water darker near me, in this way the bridge will be more visible. Now I add violet to my old mix of colors. And you can see how darker is my nearest part of the water. I put some waves, very light lines for the all water and to go to fill left side from the paper. With the same dark mix, I mean ultramarine or the blue, red and some violet, I draw mountains in the background. I draw the place closer to the sun in orange. Even I don't know, maybe it's not mountains, maybe it's some forest or some island. You can create what you want. I think for mountains it's uh, not so high. So I draw the bridge with a warm mix of yellow and orange.
I add violet to the mix, what I used before, and draw the knee part of the bridge and the lines between the ports. I paint the railings with a dark mix that I used for the mountains. Adding details. This dark color I show dark part of the wood. I use a thin brush to draw the ports and all the elements of the bridge. It seems to me that elements from the bridge not so dark as I want and I put another layer of dark mix to the dark part of the railings. And I like it much more when it starts to be with more contrast.
after I put the contrast, it seems to me that the bridge was too bright. With a quick and wild brush movements, I add a shade of the violet. I try not to make the bridge too dark. It's important not to get a fight between the bridge and the water. The water should remain darker. I am adding a shadow from the railing. I use ultramarine and a mix of past color from the bridge. A few more details between the boards with the same color. At the end, I add white highlights. And spontaneously, I had a few more dark little objects, what look like stairs. I'm happy with the result I got. 
This is exactly the picture I wanted. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed the process. See you soon. Bye.